Hey, what's up, guys? <clears throat> so I decided to do something a little bit different. Recently, I've been reviewing um, the Legacy Series stuff, like, back-to-back, -back, like, like a bunch. Um, I decided to switch it up and do something different. So I'm super excited today to show you this because, okay, so a couple weeks, like a, like a week or two ago, I had gone to the store and I found a really cool Bakugan, right, at Target. And I was like, wow. And I know he, I know I said that I was going to wait for like a uh, Nova Dragonoid until I found him in Diamond. And um, I was going to, but I didn't, I honestly, I swear to you, I did not know they had this Bakugan out. Like I, I, like I saw it on the checklist, I think. And I just, I, I don't think it registered in my head, you know, that it, that it existed. But today I got off of work. Um, and I went to the store, I went to Target again, because I was just like, you know, you know, whatever. Like, I might as well just check. And they restocked, okay? And they have this guy, dude. I, I completely forgot about him, Hanaj. I'm guessing, let me zoom out a little bit. I'm guessing that he, um, what's it called? He, he's the main villain, Bakugan, that's what I think. Um, at first I thought he was Chaos, but he's actually Auralus. Um, I'm not sure if that's like a misprint or anything like that, but yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, but up there he is, um, Arliss. Um, and why I was mentioning that is because, look, this is what I found at Target also. I found this guy a while ago. This is the Nova, um, Dragonoid Exynelius. Dude, this is so cool. I got both of them. Um, I'm guessing they're gonna fight at some point. Um, but yeah, so let's just get started. Let's unbox them. So... I haven't I I um I haven't been posting a lot recently. Um I said in my last video it's because like kind of, things have been kind of going crazy. Um I've been like going to school a lot a lot more and I've also been working a lot. Uh last week I did like a 12-hour shift and it was kind of crazy. <laughs> it was um uh what's it called? I did it by accident too. It was like I I had asked my manager if I could like um, if she needed like any extra people because she was like two people I called off in the morning and I'm not like I'm not like a crazy person or anything like that like I know my, my limits but I was like oh uh, if you want me to come in in the morning that's fine and she's like you sure you close and I was like yeah that's cool because I because I, our store closed at like eight because I work in fast food <laughs> I work at a Starbucks which is kind of like lame but it is what it is because it's low-key I mean it's looking kind of good for right now because I'm in school and their hours are pretty okay. But anyway, um, until I can get like a real job, you know, <laughs> but yeah. Um, so yeah, I had worked a 12 hour shift that day, um, but it is what it is. So here are the cards for the Nova Dagonoid Exnelius. There they are. Let me, let me see if I can zoom in a little. There it is. Pretty good card art, I guess. Uh, 202 you guys let me know if that's good um, and I guess if it lands on a shield that it fuses which this is a background dude that looks really cool look at that I'm not sure what that V means or that minus mark maybe that means take off a core I think but yeah 800 B power and then five uh, I forgot what that symbol means I think I think damage I think that's what it means all right, and then here's the second one, Hanaj. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I haven't watched a lot of the show. I only watched like a few, like a handful of episodes. I actually did watch the finale for Evolutions, which honestly, it wasn't even that bad. I kind of, I could see if, if people enjoyed it, I could definitely see why. Um, Wrath is kind of an, uh, like, like a crazy person, Bakugan, you know what I mean? Like he's like, he's not right in the head. Uh, cause he, like, I guess he died in the show, right? Oh, this is spoilers, so, oh my bad. <laughs> Sorry if you guys didn't watch it, but, yeah, so he, I guess he gets, like, killed or something like that. Um, oh, that looks cool. He looks raw. Dang, 310 damage. But 300 Bs and then 10 damage. That looks cool. Oh, yeah, and then he's not fused on the back, I forgot. But here's the gate card. That actually looks really cool. He always looks raw. I know they're, um... I know they're changing Nilius to back to two heads, which I don't, I don't, I mean, it is like, I don't really care, but like, I don't know. That's an interesting thing to do. Okay. All okay. oh, right. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, I guess <clears throat> my phone knocked, like 
because I recorded on my phone and it knocked over. Um, but yeah, it was an excuse to like set everything up. So I'm just using like one of the gate cards that I found in there. And yeah, here's what they look like in their ball form. Um, pretty cool. This guy does not look R-less like at all. It looks more like chaos, which honestly, I like what they're doing in the reboot where they're making like the villains like not necessarily darkest. Um, I guess Nilius is kind of a villain, but because we had Wrath, we had Tico, um, and now I guess we have Hanaj. Um, and then who was the guy from the last time? I don't remember who Geogon Rising was. Or Armored Alliance. Oh, sorry. Battery wanted. Uh, but yeah, I don't remember Armored Alliance or Geogon Rising. Because I didn't watch those. Um, I didn't watch any of it, to be honest. But yeah. So I think we'll just start off with Dragonoid X Nilius. And can I just say, dude, he looks awesome. Um... In evolutions, they made them look really like bad, but uh, he does, he's not like super detailed, uh, like in the paint department. But he's insanely detailed on like texture and like design. You know what I mean? Like, look, you can see like the grooves. I guess what are supposed to be like scales and stuff like that. And then yeah, I like these. Oh, sorry for my thumb. I like sorry, <laughs> but yeah, wow, he looks just super cool. So let's see if he lights up. Ooh, I really like that. Wow. See, I would think that they would like, um, what's it called? That they would have some sort of, uh, I wonder what's his activation. Is it his tail? Um, no. What is it? Maybe his wings. Come on. This guy is a little <laughs> difficult to close. Oh, this wing gets stuck. Oh, okay, I guess it is his wing. Um, something like that. Okay, anyway. So yeah. So he does I would I would have thought that they would do like um flash between Darkus and um and Pyrus. Um I guess not. I mean it still looks cool either way. Wow, the camera makes it look really cool. I don't know if you guys will see that. But yeah, that looks really nice. The darkest and the um Pyrus faction symbols, um, but yeah, that's what I thought they would do. He's he's really fat, <laughs> he's really chunky, uh, but yeah, I would have thought that they would do that, but I guess not. They're probably just like saving on um, the electronic bits, um, just so it doesn't end up like Genesis Dragonoid or anything like that. But yeah, or maybe they'll do another version where it's darkest and like Nilius is the the head of the body. Um, yeah, that looks really cool. I really like that. And now it's Hanaj, and I've been, I actually was really excited for this guy, um, because I was, I wanted, uh, because the villain Bakugans, honestly, they haven't been really that disappointing. I know in season one, we didn't get it, like an actual villain Bakugan, like a physical Bakugan, um, other than Nilius, and he's really cool, but, you know, Atiko, oh, Villoc, I'm so dumb, I literally just remembered him, I, I, I really like Villoc, Villoc is an awesome design, um, but yeah, so, super cool he he's you know he's not really too impressive in his ball form um i do really like his like grooves and stuff like that like i said with um drago xenilius i don't know if you can see him he is really clear for an r list i thought they would like give him like a little bit either of like a like a tint or like um at least like a different plastic because he really does look chaos and i think it's going to be a little bit um what do you call um people who are expecting a chaos villain bakugan again um but yeah anyway yeah he he looks pretty okay on the outside um these these look really nice and he does have the gold faction symbol on there 300 bees i'm not sure if it's normal for the b power to be on the outside i don't really pay attention too much um i guess not because drago x Nilius has it on the inside but yeah so let's roll him out and let's see what he has to offer oh he got stuck I got whoa Ooh. wow okay <laughs> so his light is white actually what's the um what's the mechanism oh it's his tail that's so bright i'm sorry if that's hurting your guys' eyes but yeah let me do it like this wow that's like an actual flashlight dang um that's really weird uh why is his light white <laughs> um Dang, I'm sorry, I did that by accident. 
wow his, it's actually hurting my eyes um but yeah so i guess in his card art he's supposed to be some sort of like dragon bakugan um he does look a lot like uh it kind of does look like nilius um with like the um four legs which i guess these are supposed to be his legs maybe like these are this is his leg and these are his arms probably i think that's how it's supposed to be um but yeah this he actually looks super super nice i really do like he looks really strong like just how he's posed um his back looks really nice too i like his wings um his arms looks like like i, I have the same idea with him as i do with like neo dragonoid with like his like um how do i explain this without sounding stupid <laughs> like the, they made his arms and his back super big right so you would uh, you would assume he's really strong you know because neo dragonoid is supposed to be the strength form um and yeah and with this like you can tell like his chest is really big and so is like his back and his wings and his arms so you would assume that he's supposed to be really strong but yeah so um i'm gonna try and close this guy because i did it the first time but i kind of did it by accident um, so his head, I guess his legs, his legs are super flimsy. Um, they're on like this weird, uh, pin thing. All right. That actually wasn't too, too bad. <laughs> let's, let's try to close this guy now. Cause this guy was a little harder or he wasn't a little hard. I guess he was like the same difficulty. <laughs> oh shoot. Okay. I guess that's how you do light it up. Sorry if that hurt your eyes. Um, okay. Put that in, put this these heads in or maybe the heads go in first and then this okay nice okay super cool so yeah these are the two um the two guys wow that's like that's really weird i don't know why he does that he got stuck and that was the second time he got stuck but yeah these are the two bakugan um that i'm assuming are going to be like the main ones um at least for the season so yeah drago x uh, nilius and then hanaj um, I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not sure. Tell me if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I'm at 26 subscribers. Let's go. Let's get to like 30 in a little while. Maybe, maybe even 35. Okay. <laughs> I know I'm pushing it, but yeah, thank you guys a lot. I really appreciate it. If you have any subject, um, sorry, suggestions or anything, let me know. Um, but yeah, bye.